Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to show some examples of mimicry. Mimicry is when an animal or plant resembles another creature or object, either for defense or to gain an advantage. Let's look at this first example. The first example is of a coral snake and a king snake. The king snake tries to look like the coral snake, which is a highly venomous, dangerous snake. The bands are similar, but not exact, but it helps keep predator away from the king snake. This next example in mimicry looks like an ant, but it in fact is a cricket in its early larva stages. It, a it is a microxophus cricket, and it resembles an ant in order to help it stay alive. This fork-tailed drongo is able to mimic the alarms of several animals. It sounds the fake alarm, the animals get scared and run off, and then it flies down and steals their food. Pretty ingenious. This next snake, the western hognose snake, wants you to think that it is a dangerous venomous snake, and it even hisses and curls up like a cobra or another venomous snake, but it is not. If all else fails, it lays on its back and plays dead. This northern pygmy owl actually mimics itself. On the left you see what it looks like on the front, and on the back you can see its fake eyes so that it looks like it's coming and going to scare predators away. Pretty smart. This next example is actually a moth. It's a large moth called the elephant hawk moth caterpillar. And as you can tell, it tries to look like a snake to scare predators away. But it, in fact, it is a harmless caterpillar. This next animal, the mimic octopus, might be the king of camouflage and mimicry. It's able to change its color and shape to look like lots of objects around it. Yes, this is the same animal on the left and the right. It's just changing color and shape. Thanks for watching examples of mimicry. And remember, Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Thanks for watching. Please share.